How's it going, everyone? Uh, just dropping some quick info. Uh, been playing around with some dumb nonsense uh, since uh, Ar Arcade Editions dropped for Street Fighter V. Uh, been playing around a little bit with Abigail in the lab and finding some really interesting things, uh, particularly concerning his uh, V-Trigger 2. Uh, you've probably seen, already seen the obvious bits, all the crazy dumb clips on like Twitch and whatnot, tri Twitter and all that. But we're going to be talking about something that's a little bit more interesting, particularly uh, as far as V-Trigger cancels are concerned. Now, as you might know, there's been some nerfs to V-Trigger cancels overall, but in regards to Abigail, he's got some options out of V-Trigger 2 that he can cancel out of exclusively for that V-Trigger. Uh, so we'll just kind of, as an example, throw this out. Uh, say in this case, Abigail Punch. Using V-Trigger 1, uh, it's impossible to cancel. But that said... Going into V uh, V Trigger Two, you get the option to cancel out of it, and this has some really interesting applications because between that and also his dash punch being canceled, that gives you options for not only corner carry but also boosting damage off of some relatively safe options. Uh, so, just as an example. Yeah, we'll throw out his poke into the X Abigail. And you can cancel and get a free uh, headbutt into the corner there. And as you can see, that's 300 life and 400 stun, as well as having your opponent in the corner, uh, just for V-Trigger activation and a bar meter. Uh, and it gets a little bit better when you're in the corner as well. So, for example, Doing his dash into punch and activating V trigger, you can cancel right into an Abigail punch. Uh, I believe you can even go so far as to get a, a medium Abigail punch off of it. And this can honestly build a lot of damage off of relatively safe options. And this has some more interesting applications, um, just because of the fact that it might not have some of the threats of uh, V-Trigger 1, but it allows you to get extra damage and stun off of some pretty safe options of his. So just as an example, you know, we'll toss his dash and punch. into that. Uh, just a basic setup, it's Abigail Punch and Super. And just like that, that's um, 400 damage, 350 stun. As you can tell, that damage scaling is really high on it, so it might not be the most efficient use of meter in this regard, but it is a case where it is an option to close out rounds. It gives you a little bit more mileage for some pretty safe options, and also leaves you in prime position for his you know, V Trigger 2 shenanigans. Uh, definitely something that might be worth playing around with a little bit. Uh, it's definitely given me the idea to, to maybe uh, put a little bit of time into maybe researching what's possible off of those options. Uh, Abigail already looks like he's going to be a really big threat in Season 3. And if there's any you know, real meat and potatoes to some of his options out of V Trigger 2, I just see that making him even scarier. So yeah, if you feel an if you feel inspired, get out there, do some training, and uh, yeah, leave some feedback. Yeah, thank you for watching, and we will catch you next time. See y'all.